everyone. Um, I've got a, uh, since I'm doing a solar project, <clears throat> I've got this uh, Evergy Elite whole house energy monitor that I've installed here. And, uh, oh wow, that's weird. No, I did not plan that. <laughs> but uh, that's showing, a, let's see, I guess that's my usage up to the moment. History, kilowatt hours. Energy now. That's more like it. <laughs> okay, so it's using uh, uh, 389 watts with kilowatt there is your 1,000 watts. And that's freaky to get that again. Okay, I don't want it to be 666. All right. <clears throat> 383 watts. And that's with no air conditioner. It's a nice, uh, cool day here in San Antonio. Here's the box, Elite. This is a version 3.0. This is actually a Canadian edition, but it, it works with the U.S. Uh, same 60 hertz, 120. Doubled up, and there's one for each of your mains in there. Let me show you a little, real quick video on how to install this unit. Okay, so the next step is it includes six batteries, double A's. Put them in the transmitter. When you pull the two wires out, pull them through uh, a hole in your existing breaker if you have one. Hopefully you do. Otherwise, you might have to run it off through the side. Um, if you are not familiar with electricity, I do recommend an electrician for this installation uh, because obviously you want to have a uh, your circuit breaker outside turn off if you have one. Okay. Okay, the next step here is to latch these over your mains, making sure to turn off your main circuit breaker first. Be very careful not to touch anything hot. Uh, they say on the other videos I saw to put the label towards the service, so my service is coming from the top, so that's the way I'm going to put it. And uh, we'll just go ahead and clamp this on right there. Okay, plug the sensor feeds into the two left side. Make sure you're ordering a U.S. Canada edition if you are in the U.S. Okay, so I just started the microwave, so it should kick up here in just a sec. So it was taking about 10, 15 seconds. There we go. 1,700 watts. <clears throat> so that's pretty cool. Now I can see what's going through my main. Uh, I don't have a smart meter here. I have a regular meter, but this is handy. Looks like it appears to be Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. Uh, but uh, I'm pretty happy with this. It was only 100 bucks on eBay or so. So that's the Effergy Elite.